Hello again and welcome uh, to the video of the Eco Topper program. Eco Topper uh, program offered by EduShore is a one year preparation course, right? So it's from the year, it's from the month June 20 year X to July 20 X plus one. Okay. What I mean by that is if it's 2019, then it'll be till 2020. That's it. Okay. Now, I receive various queries. Uh, what are you going to do in this course? So, the Eco Topper course, our basic focus in this course is to solve the past papers of ISI, DSC, and the JNU. Okay. As I said in my earlier video, we at EduShore basically focus on the top four institutes of the country, which are as follows ISI, DSC, JNU, and Nigeria. Right? So, in our one year course, we basically focus on the last 15 years past papers of ISI, DSC, JNU. IJRDR only has uh, sample papers, they don't actually release out their uh, past papers. Okay, so 15 years of ISI, DSC, JNU will cover approximately 80% of the one year course, right? So in the Eco Topper program, I will expect a student to be comfortable with 20% of the class being theory and 80% of the class being about problem solving. Which problems am I solving? I am not solving any other problem other than ISI, DSC, and the JNU past paper problems. Okay, so uh, much of the theory also is covered while actually solving problems. Many of the concepts which I do will be while solving the problems of the past papers. Classes for the program will be two times a week and the schedule can be seen on our website. Just to uh, give you a glimpse on the topics that we will be covering in this, you can take a look at this. For the maths section, just put a glance on all the topics that we are covering. Right, these are all the topics that we covered. For economics part, these are all the topics that we covered. These are all the important topics that uh, come in these entrance examinations, starting from consumer behavior to uh, markets in uh, microeconomics, and uh, starting with an SKM ISLM to an open economy ISLM ADAS, uh, solo model, balance of uh, payments, so on and so forth, trade, we cover all these in uh, macroeconomics and you know, trade topics. Also, our methodology of uh, teaching is going topic wise. So what do I mean by that? When I do suppose the topic functions in maths, I talk about the theory of uh, functions firstly, in the first part of the class. And then I go into solving ISI, TSC, and JNU past paper problems, which are related with the topic functions. Then I go into, say, microeconomics, and I start off with consumer behavior. So then I do the theory of consumer behavior. Then I go into ISI, TSC, and the JNU past papers of consumer behavior, right? The reason why we go topic wise is it is uh, quite easy to actually when the theory is fresh in your mind to solve ISI, DSC and the JNU problems. If we go year wise, like first we do the year 2018, we have one, two, three, up till 40 problems from a particular year and we look at say First problem is from the topic function. Second problem is from the topic SKM. Third problem is from the topic, say, maxima minima. And the 40th problem is, say, from econometrics. Right? So if we have this, 
it will be very very difficult for us to switch topics right so once you know the theory of a particular topic it is uh, you know very easy and uh, very systematic to actually do the isi dsc and the jnu problems of that particular topic you will also be able to solve uh, problems in an easier way because my theory teaching is actually suited to solving you know these problems so when the theory is actually fresh in your mind uh, you will be able to solve these problems uh, more efficiently right so firstly i finish off all these topic wise isi dsc and the jnu problems and it's my aim to finish off all of them by the month of march of the next year so from june to march i finish off all these topics then i go year wise then i go into revision year wise so that all of you get used to thinking about all the topics all at once so then i go year wise then i look at the 2018 paper and then i look at the 2017 paper so on so forth right so firstly i do all the topics right so you revise all the topics and then from april onwards i go year wise into the doubt classes now what are the learning tools that i use for eco topper and the eco masters course for that kindly look at my general course features video which will give you an idea thank you see you in the next